Hello everyone, this is Ariel here. Welcome to this tutorial of how to install Kali Linux on my computer. So, let's start. The first thing we need to do is create a new partition. For that, we go to Disk Utility, select our disk, and then click on Partition. In there, we can create a new partition. I will set mine with 50 gigs, format MS DOS, and name KL. Click on Apply and Partition in order to create the new one. When the process is finished, a message like this will be displayed. Now, we need to create a bootable drive. I'm gonna use this application which its link is in the description below. Then copy it into applications and close all the windows. Now we can plug in our USB drive and open the application. Find and select the ISO file. Select the operating system as Debian installer and then start the process. Enter your password and click OK. This will take a while. Be patient. When the process finished, we quit the application and restart our computer. As soon as you hear your Mac startup shine, hold and press the option key to enable the boot options. Select the FE boot option and press enter. Go to installer and press enter again. Select your favorite configuration and continue. Again, this will take a while. Be patient. Set your hostname and password and continue with your configuration. At the partition disks, select manual and you will have a screen like this. Go to the partition we've created before and press enter. Then go to the delete partition option and enter again. Now our partition is free space. We have to go back and select guided partition using the largest continuous free space and press enter. Select all files in one partition and continue. Then select Finish partitioning and write changes to disk and press enter. Select yes to apply the changes and continue. Now our Kali Linux system is being installed. And this is the last process we need to await. End up configuring the package manager and bootloader. And at this point, we have all ready to get into Kali Linux. We wait for the reboot, and at the startup, we can switch between the systems. Press C to open a command line and type exit to get into Mac OS or simply press enter to get into Kali Linux. Type your username and password and sign in. Now we have Kali Linux already installed. That has been all for today. Hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and see you here in another tutorial.